Yo, what's going on guys? Kevin Lifts here. Welcome to another video. Welcome to the channel. Hope you guys are doing good. Today's Monday, the 11th of September. I'm currently at the gym right now. Going to do my cardio and steps and mobility and some ab work. Um, this is just a habit now. Just going to keep this in just to keep, you know, healthy and make sure my heart is all good and working fine. And yeah, I'm just going to take you guys through a little day in the life sort of and how I'm going to tackle this bulk push-up phase. So yeah, let's get to it. I recently bought these Vivo Barefoots. Yeah, they're really nice, really comfy, but I really only use them for cardio step, leg day, and when I'm doing deadlifts. Again, um, well, I guess it helps my foot muscles. Um, feels really good, comfy. Just a little bit expensive, but I think they're worth it. guys usually have one or two meals before I train but today I'm only gonna have one eggs bacon banana bagels cream of rice with some frozen fruit and yeah so yeah I got legs today this is gonna be the fuel let's get it All right guys, time to go to the gym. It's legs day, legs day, leg day. Hyped, got some pre, I'm gonna be saying that through. Um, then yeah, I'll show you guys through the workout. Don't know if I'm gonna be doing any talking or you're just gonna hear a lot of grunting or whatever. So yeah, let's get to it. Big legs, big legs. Hi guys, so just finished off that leg session, fully send it. Um, feels good to train like hard again. Cause remember on prep, I was literally like just dying and didn't want it. Uh, I did want to train, but like not, crazy hard um like not high intensity but yeah anyway we started with the adductors oh After this, we moved on to seated hamstring curls. These felt freaking amazing, painful. Yeah. Let's go. heavy and then we moved on to some leg extensions two sets here let's go Uh, uh, oh, fuck. Then we got into our big compound movements, did the Smith squat, really loving this. I really want four plates, maybe five if we can get to it eventually. But yeah, we got three and three quarters and I think we got like seven, maybe eight reps. Yeah, yeah. That's oh. what you want to do, so that's why I did five plates in the Yep. Stick deep, bro. Oh, come on. Say thank you, everyone. Let's go. 
Nothing. Done for. Yeah. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh. Big set. Just make a count. Get that, get that first one done. Oh. Nice and easy. Slow. Get that first one tight. Yeah. Nice. Good set. Right, let's go. Two. Oh. Let's go. Three. Up. Oh. Tight, mate. Tight. Four. Oh. Yeah, come on, Ed. Get a five. Come on. Let's get a five. Let's get out of the way. Up. Oh. Try and drive, drive your glutes forward, though. Way up. Rather than using your lower back. Let's go. Keep it tight in. Drive up in. Much better. Oh. Much better. Let's go. Come on. In. Keep it in, keep it in. Good. One more. Let's go. Come on, in. In. Oh. Woo. Cheers. Fuck yeah. Then we went on to this hip press. Love this machine. Again, great on the quads and the whole leg, I guess. Feel a bit of glue too. And then we moved on to some calves, which I did not record. Sorry. So yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna eat. Have a little. Anyways, I'm gonna eat right now, and then we're gonna do some work. Then I'm gonna do some stuff later because I need to move around and yeah, move this lactic acid, quote unquote, and just be good for me to walk for my mental and everything. Right. Anyways, I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye. All right. Post workout meal. We got cocoa pops and a scoop of whey. Don't know if you can hear this. Okay, probably not, but yeah, that's post-workout, good carbs, and protein. Alright guys, it's currently like 5 and I'm having another meal, so right here I've got, I don't even know how many grams of chicken, not gonna lie, this is probably like, this is like a whole chicken, this is like a whole chicken breast, so it's like 200, maybe 250 grams, and then we got pancit, pancit is like a, yeah, I don't know how to explain, it's a Filipino dish, and it's good. I think it's good in calories and macros, so yeah. Can he enjoy that now? All right, guys. So on to the main topic of the video. So this is how I'm going to be planning my bulk. I started like two or three weeks ago now. And yeah, feeling really good. We're going to try and push maybe 5, 10, maybe even 15 kilos, depending how the body composition looks. I'll show a physique update 
maybe now or next episode or, or next video but yeah so first thing first diet wise i'm gonna be on a surplus now um again i don't want to be in a massive surplus i just want to be slight so i can have more energy better my performance at the gym get stronger and yeah make progress each and every week um if i have too much of a surplus i'm just gonna gain a lot of unwanted body fat i kind of want to stay relatively lean so yeah um i'll eventually get chubby and you know bare face but it is what it is i'm still doing steps or trying to aim between eight to twelve thousand steps a day i'm also doing cardio three to five times a week as well again for heart health and i just like doing cardio because then i can watch anime you know um i love anime right now i'm watching baki it's sick it gets me hype my heart rate probably goes higher because of that but yeah in terms of my calories and macros if you guys are interested i'm literally doing a training day and non-training day on my training day i'm doing like i think i'm doing like 2600 calories and on my non-training day or rest day is like 2300 i also get one to two off-plan meals a week which is great because then i can use that plan to either spend the time with my family friends whatever um whatever i feel like or if i'm alone i could just spend it all by, by myself but yeah um that's diet in terms of training i am training five times per week i am doing legs push pull rest push pull rest i'm hitting majority of the body parts at least twice i'm also going to work on the body parts that i got from the judges feedback um which is basically everything but um so upper body thickness and density as well as getting my hammies and glutes like my quads are okay but they will get better but but in more particular my hammies and my glutes and probably my calves i'm doing abs like five to six times a week right now because i don't really have the best ab genetics that they don't they don't really pop out i want them to be like blocky next time i'm on stage like yeah so that's the game plan i'm planning to gain like maybe one to two pounds a week i'm currently weighing around 185 to 188 in the morning which is not bad i want to get to maybe 200 205 something like that and then reassess maybe if i'm getting too fat cut back down and bulk, bulk up again but it is what it is we'll see what the plan goes right now just enjoy myself i'll document more things that i'll be doing it's coming up to my birthday and i got a lot of things planned and yeah a lot of food challenges as well so I mainly put my off-plan meal on that food challenges. Sometimes it's even a full cheat day, but it's all good because yeah, I'm in off-season. I'm like enjoying myself. I'm not being too strict. I'm like, you know, I need to enjoy my life as well. You know, there's that balance and yeah, I wanna spend it with my loved ones and everything. But yeah, I don't wanna get too deep. But anyway, that, that's the game plan. If you guys enjoyed, hit the thumbs up, comment down below what you wanna see next. And yeah, let's get it going. Bulk season. Let's go.